I wondered if we could just talk about one or two of the pieces that yeah. you showed in yeah. in Lorient mm -hmm. and talk about which lines they they reflect, which elements. Okay. Well, um, if I go through this whole, this is so this is nine lines from the deer's cry, which is sort of separated out. So it seems to be like a salutation of the day. Um, and so it starts, it's, I arise today through strength of heaven, light of sun, radiance of moon, splendour of fire, speed of lightning, swiftness of wind, depth of the sea, stability of earth and compactness of rock. So yeah, that's the nine. So the really interesting one, I think, is the I arise today through strength of heaven. And I, that just came to me and I was looked into, into the planets and it just seemed to fit with with having um, the planets within it and the Vitruvian man in the centre. Because also uh, after the Yomkriniak logo, I spoke to uh, a friend who's a shaman. And he said the really important thing with Triscals is that there should be something in the centre because the centre is where creation comes from, um, which I hadn't really known about. So that's the difference between those and the early ones. So that's so these ones have something in the centre. So yes, we have sort of man, woman, you know, in, in the centre of that. In the sort of there's a golden figure in this sort of silver light really, and with the, the universe behind. Um, and then, you know, we have the radiating moon, um, which I, I just really love that one, the, sort of the colours, I love the moon and, the, you know, the full moon feeling, so that's a, a favourite one of mine. And I think the compactness of rock one was interesting because I went down to um, the Calf of Man and um, it was a tr actually a trip organised by the people that I do meditation with, actually, and one of the teachers was on the trip and she, and she was teaching me about creativity and meditation so it was, a very, it was kind of like the turning point in the whole show and I had been drawing guillemots before that but you know the rocks there are so fantastic that the guillemots seem to fit in to the compactness of rock sort of feeling and it's also this is all linked with man's everything being connected and man's place in nature so that's and, 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 yeah, yeah the nature with that and then it's like you have the lightning it's like everything it's like this was the last one to complete be completed half an hour before the exhibition was due and it's like the lightning at the center going which is quite powerful as well i hadn't really realized how they would all look like that. i was going to do them as a line actually um, and we didn't have as much space as we thought in lorion and hung them as a, as a nine like this and it's far more powerful so it works well because it's three rows of three as yeah. well, which links yeah. back to the Triscoll, yeah. so it does make it a, a very perfect. powerful collection. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely.